Good afternoon and welcome to another episode of the Keswick Ripple Podcast. My name is Jim Lang. I'm the Director of Guest Services and Assistant to the President and CEO here at America's Keswick. And each week we want to bring you a testimony that we hope encourages your heart and life. One of the most dynamic parts of our program is that when a man or woman comes in, uh, they are radically changed by the gospel of Jesus Christ and they're sent back out to their churches, their families and communities and God uses them in a mighty way. And so today I want to introduce you to Anthony. Uh, Anthony is getting ready to graduate the Colony of Mercy and, and head back home. And so, Anthony, welcome and thank you for taking some time to share your story. Thank you. All thank right. you. Glad to be here. So why don't you start out by telling everyone kind of what life was like before coming to the Colony? Uh, so before coming to the Colony, life was just chaotic for the most part. I was doing whatever I wanted. I had no regards to anything. I'm married. I have an infant. And when it even came to them, I was present with them, but I wasn't present. Uh, I was just, you know, a lost soul to speak. Yeah. And so how did you come to hear about the colony? What finally made you decide to come? So my wife's a Christian and she kept telling me, you need to go away, you need to go away. And I was, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, Anthony did what Anthony, Anthony wanted. And I, you know, I hit that point where I was just completely broken. And I just remember her bringing up America's Keswick and, you know, I just, one day I ended up calling Terry, and it was the best decision I ever made. Awesome. So uh, you've been here for pretty much four months now. What is the main thing that God uh, kind of pressed in on your heart while you were here? Oh, I mean, pressed in my heart that, you know, it's his world. It's his way because when I do things his way, it's everything's great. When I do it my way, it's shambles. And I learned that, you know, he sacrificed his son for us. And if he could do that, I could sacrifice the things I want to do. And so you, you've been to other programs before, you've been to the rehabs before. What, what kind of makes the Colony of Mercy different than, than other programs? So the programs I've been to before were secular programs. So pretty much it was, you know, you get off the street for 30, 90 days and still kind of just do what you want. This place, you know, it, it, uh, America's Keswick showed us how to live everyday life with work, uh, praying, reading the Bible, leaning on the Lord, and it just changed my whole way of life and how I look at life. So you mentioned you're married, and so uh, yes. one of the programs we have here is for Families for Christ, where you know your wife gets to come and come for the weekend, and you guys get some counseling. How, how has that impacted uh, your marriage? It's impacted my marriage greatly. Uh, so before coming here, we were on the rocks. I honestly thought when I got here, I was going to get served divorce papers. And through FFC, me and my wife have a better bond than ever before. It brought us closer to God together. And it's just, it broke boundaries between us and we hit new levels. And it's, it was a great thing. That's awesome. So um, more than likely, there's probably someone out there watching this podcast who's struggling with addiction. What would you say to them today? If you're struggling, call America's Keza because this place really changed my life. It's helped me drastically. And... You know, without God, with God, everything is possible. Well, Anthony, thank you for taking some time to share your testimony. We hope Anthony's testimony encouraged your heart and life, and we will see you next week. Have a great day.